Take your hood off. Take my hood off? Yes. Is that a law? Yes, in the library of taking your hood off. What's the difference between a hood and a hat? Yep. Right, right. You want to record me, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I could be all up in the camera, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Leave the building. Leave, yeah. leave the building. Why, well, so what have I done? You know what you did. No, what did I do, sir? Is it my hood? What's the car? What's the car? Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is News Now Ninja, and today's video comes to you from St. Louis, Missouri, and was recorded by an up-and-coming new channel, Central Tyrant Investigations. And not only does this man do an excellent job of staying cool, calm, and collective in the face of tyranny, but he does an excellent job of following through to get updates and stays on top of the situation until something's resolved. Make sure and stick around to the end of the video to find out what happens to this tyrant security guard. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to get to the link for Central Tyrant Investigations and let them know in the comment section News Now Ninja sent you, and let's get straight to the action. Get your high school little diploma here. I got your uh, gun locks available. He said that he can take them. He can do that. Yeah, I can show those. Oh, we're welcome, guys. Is that a law? Yes, in the library of taking it off. Is that a law? Off. A law or a policy? Policy. Yeah, I go by law, man. <laughs> okay, well, if you go take your hood off, you have to go outside. What's the difference between a hood and a hat? And I don't appreciate being recorded either. You're in public. That's, okay, so you're in public, right? Right, yeah. In the library, right? There's no expectation take your hood of privacy off, in public, man. What's the difference between my hood and your hat? Take your hood off. Well, somebody's wearing a hat. So you there. want to be combative. <laughs> Sir, Police. look behind you. Don't record me. Look Into behind police. you. Let's go. I'm good here, man. No, you're not. Let's go. All right, this guy is, uh, this guy is uh, escalated here. Yep. Right, right. You want to record me, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I could be all up in the camera, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah, take your as ass out of the building. As long as your breath does. As long as you can get out of my building. As long as your breath does. Okay, you want to play now? How's this your building? You want to play stupid? Hey, his breath kind of does stink, guys. He needs a breath mint. You ain't wash your ass. I didn't wash my butt. You didn't? Oh, then you want to wash it for me? Leave the building. No, I'm good here. It's a public building. It's a public building? Yeah. Leave the building. Why, so what have I done? You know what you did. No, what did I do, sir? Is it my hood? Oh, we weren't even What's the fuck? What's the car? What's the car? Now I just did All that. Alright, guys. Now I just did that. Yep. Now you can leave. Yep. And you're going to be under arrest for that, oh, too. Oh, You can leave now. That's, I see. that's assault. Hey, get out. He assaulted me, man. I didn't see it. No, it's okay. I got it on camera and GoPro, so. Okay. Alright, this guy just uh, broke my equipment here. Yeah, I did. Now you can leave. I suggest you back up. I suggest you, what you gonna do? Yeah, you just you broke this my, my face, right? You just broke you my, my face, right? Well, what you gonna do about it? Now what you gonna do about it? All right, guys, this guy just uh, broke my equipment yep. here. I will be calling law enforcement. Okay. They will be coming here and yep. arresting him. They won't. <laughs> now I asked you three or four times to leave the building. You still wanna be here? Okay. I'm still recording. Okay. Call the cops like you say you will call. I will. Thank you. So will I. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Yep. Yep. She knows a little bit more. Do you know who this woman is on Friday? I haven't even clue. I wasn't even in on that. Wow, guys. Are you still recording? Just, uh, broke my equipment here. I don't know if you can't see that, but that holds my mic. Yes. Can I have the police here at 3309? Um, South Grand? Yes. 
Um, there's a guy here with a camcorder, followed me around with the camera directly in my face. Tell I me. asked him, could he leave? Yeah, and then you he assaulted me. me. You take the shit off, and I asked him twice, three or four times, and he put the camera in my phone, so I smacked this phone and leave for mine. That is not what happened. <laughs> tell the truth. It's recorded. Tell, tell the truth, bud. He's black. Tell the truth. Yeah, guys, so uh, this guy here decided to uh, assault me, break my equipment. So, Officer McCray, SBAN, Let's try to put this back up here. Man, he slapped the mess out of it, too. Wow, guys, so this guy thinks he can just uh, smack and break my equipment and then get away with it. So, yeah. You don't record my phone and my personal business on what's on my device. But you break mine? Don't, don't. You broke my stuff. What you can do man. is leave. I don't need to leave. This is a public building. Nice try, though. You guys know he's screwed. <laughs> he didn't break my equipment, so. I don't give a damn. You don't have to give a damn, man. The people watching give a damn, that's for sure. You got this problem. I'm going to call Trevor. Yeah. That's probably a good idea. Wow. Hello. Yeah, I understand. What can I do for you? Oh, they got cameras, guys. So, uh, we're going to stand back here and wait for uh, law enforcement. Talking about there's no hoods in here. Guys, people are wearing hats. There's uh, there's uh, women wearing these head coverings. She's wearing a hoodie. But when I come in to record, uh, he's got a problem with it. There it is. Finally found it right here. Completely broke my mount there. Sean McVeigh. Perfect. I'm doing this. I don't want you to put me on no camera. Then why would you come up to the cameraman and talk to? Because <laughs> you're not supposed to be up without my consent. Ma'am, you're in public. This is my consent. It's still you don't public. have expectation of privacy in public. I'm trying to. I'm trying to exercise my right of. Uh, you can't not sit press. here. I don't want to be on your camera. Then why would you come up to the person with the camera and ask a question? That sounds stupid. Yeah, that's what the police on. Yeah. These people are, like, this is ridiculous. These people are, they think they have an expectation of privacy in public. And I don't know where they get this information from, but it's, it's just tired. Explaining myself every single time. All right, so at this point, law enforcement has been contacted, but before cops get there, another security guard and a park ranger are about to show up, and let's see what they got to say. How are you doing? I'm going to shake some hands right now. How are you doing? doing good. All right, I heard you wanted to make a complaint against an officer. Uh, a security guard. Okay. Yeah. Right, well, what? Can you tell me what happened? Yeah, so I was just coming in here. I go around and I uh, record, like, public libraries, post offices, all that. I disseminate that information to the public, whoever watches my videos. Okay. I post a numerous things tiktok youtube all that um i came in and he was trying to tell me to take my hood off but that's that's a policy it's not a law and i walked in here there's plenty of people got hat coverings on so i don't know why he singled me out or it's anything not a, it's not the same i'm stopping okay okay yeah don't mean to be yeah no you're it's not the same thing guys it's our policy to make sure everybody's safe yeah. we've had a lot of incidents where people come in with hoods case they face they grab somebody's phone and they run out oh so really it's, so it's it's a safety thing yeah for us. So could you please remove your hood? Well, we like, just I, I just want to know, what's the difference between a hood and a hat? A hat isn't covering your face. So if I have my hat on... I mean, my face is... <laughs> you know, you know, but you know how they wear their hoods. Yeah. All right, hold on. It's all about safety and security, because with a hoodie, you can't see your face, is what the security guard says that's wearing a mask. Anyways, these two do a bunch of security cops explaining, but let's go ahead and jump to when the officers arrive. What's going on, man? How you doing? I'm hanging in there. How are you? <laughs> Could be better. Okay, um, the, what's going on? The security guard inside of there, yeah. uh, he was trying to tell me to take my hood off. I was trying to let him
him know that I don't have to. Um, and then he uh, he got r really close up to my camera here, and I was like this, and when I hit this, he smacked my camera. The mic broke off of it. Uh, you, you got the microphone? Yeah. He broke the piece. It's not expensive. Oh, sorry about that. It's not expensive or anything, but uh, he did break it. So. And then this is this is, holds is that, actually is the, that the holder, camera. Yeah, the camera. Yep. And it goes. Excuse me, I'm, I'm gonna sneeze. Oh, no, you're good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Something. He, no, no. The sun it out. is. Yep. No, I've been uh, I've been sneezing yeah, for a while. <laughs> uh, I don't know if it's allergies or not. Yeah. So. But no, uh, this is the piece right here. Okay. Yeah, and then that goes on there, and then that slides into here, and then the mic goes like this. Okay. And he smacked it. He actually left. I saw him pull away. But I was just trying to file a report, basically. Okay. Um, because he did break mine. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Do you have ID on you? Not, uh, I no, ask, I don't. I'm just asking yeah. some questions. Yeah, yeah. What's your last name, man? Uh, to make me feel old, uh, yeah, man, yeah. and just a good address for you. Uh, I don't, I don't give out my address. Yeah, okay, you're yeah, fine. Yeah, you're yeah, fine yeah, with yeah. that. Okay. All right. Hey, you want to stay here for a sec? Yeah, yeah. I can I'm, stay I'm, here. Yeah. I already talked to that uh, regular, okay. that guy there. He seemed pretty cool. So yeah, he's a, he's a good guy. Yeah, he is. I, I noticed that. So. Okay. Yeah, Mr. Uh, yeah. Give me like five, ten minutes. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Right yep. back. Awesome. Thank you. So at this point, Central Tyrant Investigations goes through the report with the officer for the destruction of his property, and together they go over the policy. But let's go ahead and jump to a week later, where he pays the visit to St. Louis Public Library Administration Office and find out what happened to the security guard. Hi. How you doing? Not bad. What's going on? How can I help you? Yeah, so I'm here to file a complaint, basically. Um, you guys, uh, do you guys hire security mm -hmm. to uh, basically oversee the public libraries? Yeah. Awesome. So I actually, um, on last Monday, I was at the, I don't know how to say it, is it the Boudur or Boudur? Boudur. Boudur location. Okay. Um, I was actually in there trying to gather information, um, disseminate that to the public, which is what I do. Um, so I do walk around there and record like what's available to the public, what's on the walls. Um, there was a security guard in there by the name of Sean Mick. Cray, yeah, Cray. Mm -hmm. um, have you? I don't know if you've heard of the situation or what. Yes, oh, you have. Okay. I am fully aware. Yeah, of that. Okay. it's awesome. About awesome. So he he broke my camera equipment. This is new equipment here. So um, I didn't know if that complaint process was. Yeah, on behalf of public safety, oh, I apologize. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. the assistant manager. Um, our manager unfortunately is not with us okay. anymore. Okay. Okay. I'm filling in. Yeah, awesome, awesome. But. Um, I'm not sure what could be done about your equipment. Yeah. Uh, Officer Mc, McCray. Mc, yeah. Mc, Mc, something. Yeah. I, Sean I, Mc, I know. Or he, he, he's only been with us for a short while, and oh, yeah. he is no longer with us. Oh, oh awesome. So, <laughs> okay. Um, if there's anything else I can do to yeah. help you, I, I'd like to, but I'm not sure. What yeah. No. I was just coming here to file a complaint, basically. Oh, yeah. Officer. Yeah. Correct. I don't know if. I didn't know at the time if anything had happened because I haven't heard anything back no. from anybody. You had you had a reason to, to file the complaint. Okay, I awesome. appreciate it. Yeah, I appreciate you, sir. Thank you for being professional. You're very welcome. Is yeah. there anything I can do uh, for you besides? So, about your library policies. Yeah. I know there's, there the officer brought out, there was a paper that said there's no recording the people, which I don't record the people, but it is a public area, and I did explain that to him. Yeah. Um, how could this be resolved to where if I do, because I was actually going to go into your downtown location. Where is your library here? With the central across the street. It's right over here? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I was, actually, I was actually referred to go to there yeah. by uh, this one of the security people in there. He was a ranger. Mm -hmm. um, he did tell me to go in there and yeah. there's awesome stuff. To we, just, so I was, we just try to respect, like, not, not even the employees, the staff, because... Yeah. We, we work for the city. Okay. We're always on surveillance. Yeah. All right. So shout out to the public library for doing what was right and firing the tyrant security guard. Though they do have some things they need to work on regarding their policies. They did what was right and shout out to Central Tyrant Investigations for staying cool during this whole situation. Keep in mind that the original video is 39 minutes long. So make sure to get to the link in the description to watch the entirety of this video. You do not want to miss it. Let Central Tyrant know that News Now Ninja sent you and I'll see you on the next one.